Okay, so some of the movements that I'm going to show you are based upon the kind of training that I practice. They call it functional training. What it does is it really basically uses movements that mimics movement patterns that you might use during, you know, whatever sport you practice. Pretend you're doing a drop turn. Okay. Okay. So now I'm going to do the same thing. So if this is my stance, right. right now I'm going to come down, but this time I'm going to take the center of my gravity over my head with the medicine ball, and then I'm going to come and step back and get a little bit deeper into my turn. Okay. So build in a little bit of strength, come back up, come back down. You can actually increase the intensity by increasing the momentum. And this makes this much harder. So if I'm in that same drop turn stance, now I'm going to swing the ball. You don't want to touch your body, right? I'm going to keep a control, tight core, swinging down, swinging up. You want to try and not have the ball hit you in your back when you bring it over your head. Okay. Good. Good. So control, come up. Come up out of that stance. Yeah. Exactly. Now come down, swing. Good. And up. Swing and down. That's it. Yeah, you can really feel that in your core. That's exactly yeah. what it's for. Yeah. So I found these simple movement patterns, especially because they really mimic what we have to do in the water. They have a major, major improvement in performance. Uh -huh. and which translates directly to having more fun, you know, staying injury free. And obviously it's a little more interesting than, you know, just sitting doing uh, bicep curls or bench <laughs> pressing in the gym.